Hai hey, semuanya, gue Zeno. Hari ini gue pengen lanjutin lagi mainin game The Tau Matter. Bakal masuk ke chapter 1 yang mana pas gue cek di achievement Steam, kenapa dia cuma ada 3 chapter ya? Chapter 1 tuh what am I doing here? Chapter 2 tuh stakes and cost. Chapter 3 this is getting serious. kan sebelumnya kan gue bilang kalau misalkan kemungkinan di sini ada 5 chapter ya <tuh> tebak-tebakan aja sih apakah chapter lainnya ada di hidden achievement atau enggak kalau misalkan chapter 1 ya bakalan panjang sih kayak gue nggak akan ngupload per chapter deh kita lihat nanti aja deh nanti gameplay gimana gue belum tahu satu chapter ini sepanjang apa kalau dari prolog kan dia sekitar satu setengah jam lah nah chapter 1 kalau misalkan emang panjang banget gue bakalan bagi per part ya kita Kali ini bakalan ke Warsaw, Warsawa untuk menguburkan ayah kita. Ya, mendadak aja ya. Tiba-tiba dapat kabar kayak gitu. Dan si Victor ini udah lama nggak pulang ke Warsaw. Jadi, kita bakalan cari tahu sih ada apa sih sebenarnya di kampung halaman kita. Kampung juga enggak sih harusnya. Jadi, kita langsung masuk aja ke game ya. Yuk. apa nih itu udah nyampe oh bukan ki Gaga horror ya. Warsaw. Oh, berbunyi. Warsaw. Warsaw. Last stop Warsaw. Time to wake up. It's clouding over. Eh. Hey, dia menemani kita. Aside from the circumstances of the funeral bringing you back, you hadn't thought of ever returning here? Uh, apa ya? Apa ya? Ini deh. The only person I consider close is my sister, but Varsovians? Let's see. Workers are striking. They want to take advantage of the Tsar's visit to Warsaw. The protests are being violently suppressed. Last week, around a dozen people were killed. Polish Socialist Party militants attacked a train. They stole money, bonds, and explosive materials. They're also suspected of robbing a transport of Dutch pomade. The Socialists in Warsaw must look pretty sharp then. <laughs> Further along, we've got murders, muggings, And poverty. The newspapers feed on sensation. Remember that in darkness, even a small spark can be seen clearly. Even I can feel hope from all the people riding with us. Can't you? Mm. Even without my powers, I can tell that hope is bringing people here from all three partitions. Miners, steel workers, governesses, maid speculators, thieves. I've forgotten to read a few of our fellow passengers' possessions, and I know that hope can have many faces. Will you share that knowledge with me? Uh, apa ya? Dua-duanya seperti tampak meyakinkan gitu. Gue coba ini deh. There's a terrified woman riding with us. She's either running away or in hiding. I think that gentleman is smuggling something, because excitement is all mixed up with guilt inside him. And this dandy, he's going whoring. If there's something I've learned in life, Victor, it's never to neglect the whores. <laughs> Orso, end of the line. Welcome to Warsaw. I think the time's come to ask where you plan to stay. I'll let you know when I come up with something. Oh. 
Gokil, rambutnya si Victor tuh selalu on point banget ya <laughs> Rambutnya keren banget gitu Polisi kayak nggak nginjak tanah deh. Eh dia pakai batik ya? Kok gue baru kayak ngeliat gitu? Kemana dia? di Steam achievementnya kok ini udah chapter 1 seperti biasa kita jalan-jalan dulu uh, gue pengen agak zoom in aja nah, kita disuruh ke sana tapi gue pengen ngeliat-liat dulu Oke. ini tahun berapa ini tahun 40-an When people unite, empires fall. Atau tahun Yang pasti sih udah lama banget ini Oh, sini uh, Banyak juga Gak boleh lari ya Kok bisa langsung slow Eh uh. ada apa nih Wah ini bakalan jadi quest kah Kita lihat nanti aja lah Banyak sih yang kayak gini-ginian Bacaan-bacaan tapi gue gak baca Eh, coba coba bentar bentar tahunnya tahun berapa sih dari tadi gue nggak tahu yaudahlah hmm. ini kenapa terang sendiri tapi nggak ada apa 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 nih? Oh kita harus ke situ. Oke. Okay. Gitu, bentar. Eh dia ngobrol sama kita. You are not from around here, are you? nggak ada yang banyak bisa kita lakukan di sini dan juga nggak ada apa-apa sih si Rasputin kemana dah eh namanya siapa Gregory Gregory harusnya udah semua Ya, mudah-mudahan gak ada yang kelewat. Kita lanjut. Oh, baru masuk sini. Act 1, ternyata. Oh, bukan chapter deh. Act berarti. Tapi kenapa di Steam-nya jadi chapter? Agak sedikit patah-patah ya. Siapa nih? These are troubled times. Brothers turn against brothers. Russia has had enough bloodshed. The violence must stop. When socialists attempt to divide Russia and her subject nations, to dent the sword that smote the enemy at Grunwald, this demands my decisive action. Thus, by my grace, 
I hereby appoint as Governor General of Warsaw Georgi Antonovich Skawon. Mm. A butcher. Butcher. Wanda, namanya sangat ini sekali ya. Uh, coba kita tanya. Not a popular guy, I presume. I see you ain't from here. That swine keeps a photo album of all the folks he's had shot at the Citadel. Before and after execution. Well, so. The time for leniency and indulgence is over. From the moment this office is bestowed on me, no forces hostile to the subjects of Greater Russia will have any further right to exist. None, whether it be brutal socialist subversives, communists, Jews, or other satanic provocateurs. Hmm. She knows how to unite a crowd. Pardon me. Are you Polish? Hmm. Ternyata si siapa tuh? Georgi Georgi Skellen tuh karakter asli. Kita bilang iya atau kita tolak. Hmm. Tolak deh. I was born in Warsaw, but I'm lapsed. My name is Victor. Vanda. Hey, double This double you. This is Russia here. Like it or not. Warsaw, Premia Terora, Sakonsuas. Idina Khoi! My first decision as Governor General of Warsaw, Aristovat. Abadu. Wong Agarti. Great heroes and their sense of timing. Of course, now they're the first ones in the fight. Samo Bladanie, Puriaki. We want that rebel. The loudmouth. Damn. Apa tu? Injata. What happened? Be a gentleman. Please kneel and tie my shoe. Hmm. Aduh, apa ya? Jadi ini aja lah. I didn't dare suggest it myself. Oh, peluru ya. Can I ask you a tiny favor? The Russians can't find out about this. The military is just looking for an excuse to suppress the crowd, and these workers are dreaming of thrashing a Russian gendarme. Either one of you confesses to disturbing the peace, or of Sieg Zabirai. We'll take you all in. You can't handle all of us. Can you get us out of here? Hmm. I think I'm open to any kind of suggestion. With a book like that, I'd find out what would convince one of these bastards to let us go. <laughs> or I'd take on that self-appointed leader of the proletariat. Interesting strategy. Hmm, apa ya? Uh, coba tanya dia siapa sih? Who are you, really? A damsel in distress. Those don't usually hide ammunition in their stockings. Can I explain it to you another time? Okay. For instance, I could disclose to a soldier that you came here with ammunition under your skirt. Maybe we should see who they believe. A respected lady of Warsaw, or a common magician who just a hundred years ago would have been burned at the stake. Well, since you asked so nicely, I'm going to take a look around. Okay. Ntar gua save dulu. Oke, kita coba keliling-keliling ya. Nyari jalan keluar nanti. Coba ngobrol-ngobrol. Do you think it's a good idea to stir people up and send them to face bullets and bayonets? What do you want then? My whole life on my knees, kissing Ruski's ass? 
Hmm. Tanya dulu, mudah-mudahan sih bisa semuanya ya. Do you realize blood is about to be spilled? And that it might be mine? Fuck off. Eh. Gaga. Coba coba coba. Tanya lagi. Do you think it's a good idea to stir people up and send them to face What do you want? My whole life on Coba. I was trying to keep from dragging ordinary people into the fight. They won't expect us to strike first. How many are coming with us? Let's see for ourselves. Nah, ada suaranya. Lah. Oh, oh. Langsung banget nih berantem. Ini gue coba ningkatin ini deh, soalnya satu-satu yang belum ini. Brutality, relaxation. Dia tuh nggak bisa digabung ya. Iya, nggak tahu gue. Coba battle awal-awal udah battle aja. Oke, kita bisa pilih salutor kita. Coba gimana cara ganti? Hmm? Halo. Oh, oke okay, kita coba dulu ya. Tester, tester. Empat puluh satu lumayan ya, gede juga. Coba ini, terus ini gue pengen coba. Ini jauh banget lagi waktunya. Gue nggak merhatiin tadi. Kita coba Quick Eh ada enemy yang lagi datang juga lu Wah bahaya Round 4 baru nyerang gila Panjang banget Oh my god Tapi kalau nggak ada darah tuh nggak enak ya. Apakah perlu gue nyalakan darahnya? Eh, salah pencet gue tadi. Langsung mati. Habis. Critical tuh ya, 10. Waduh, datang lagi. Pakai pistol lagi. Disable the trait. Hmm, gue coba ini. yang actionnya itu apa di sini coba coba ya gue actionnya gue ganti fast apakah emang beneran cepat atau enggak uh, ini gue kok nggak bisa bisa ya ini dah mana ini aduh mampus Kita punya pistol Sejak kapan? Lah kok masih nggak bisa sih itu? Hmm. 
No sea mati. Waduh. Ya. Eh. Lah, kok udah langsung ini? Gue belum keliling-keliling. Ya, kecepatan dong. Kita kehilangan buku sama pistol kita. Shulski. Victor. One of those Shulskis? Yes. Kok tahu? My condolences. Now, profile. Thank you. What you pissing in the bucket for, asshole? Where else am I supposed to? Brown in the bucket, whiz on the wall. Yeah, lagi. You better remember that too. That bucket's gonna last you guys till tomorrow. Can I use the phone? Lah, kok tiba-tiba langsung kemari ya? Nanti kita bakalan bisa keluar. What are you staring at, Ganef? I don't know what that means. Quit squealing. First time in the big city? Have some respect if you don't know who you're running your mouth at. He's one of them that went after the Ruskies with his bare fists. Hmm. Nah, ini nggak bisa. Uh, apa ya? Ini dah. For being innocent. Same as all of us. Well, are you from somebody? Hmm. Aku aja nggak ngerti. Get what you're asking. Good thing you're asking and not just running your mouth like some people. The question is, do you got a backer in town? You set up with somebody? Do you work for somebody? Uh, 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 diri aja. My name's Viktor Shulski, and I work on my own behalf. All right, respect. First of all, I am a thaumaturge. What the fuck? Now them, I got respect for. I know one really decent Jew from Povishla who's a wizard too. How about you? You got a foreskin or what? Is my foreskin any of your fucking business? Well, no. I, I was just... Schmuck. But you don't look like much of a Warsaw lad. Hmm. Yeah. I'm just here for my father's funeral. I hope you don't miss the funeral toast. Welcome to Warsaw. Okay, sih kita bisa keluar sih harusnya. Coba duduk. I wouldn't call you a master strategist. You got away from the station, so theoretically, we achieved our goal. <laughs> You're not losing your sense of humor. I guess this isn't your first time in a place like this, is it? Uh, I spent a little time on the Rue de la Raquette in Paris. It got demolished five years ago. Oui. What about you? You seem to know your way around this setting. You been here often? I'll take that as a compliment. And sure, sometimes, if the cause demands it. What cause? Let's say I know certain folks who'd find poles like you useful. Dealers in stolen Dutch pomade? Donut connoisseurs. They met at Burke Rotblitz's cafe. Mudah-mudahan sih bisa tanya dua-duanya ya. Gue ini dulu deh. I don't want to jinx it, but do you spend time there too? If I'm not there, no one will want to talk to you. And don't worry, I don't usually hang out long in places like this. Widi. Dia bisa kabur tuh, ceritanya. Shulski! I see you won't be hanging out here long <laughs> either. Nah, ternyata 
Gak bisa. Sholsky, this yours. That's right. Kita. Then take it and get out of here. Uh, siapa nih? Nggak bebasin kita? Uh, udah, oke, okay. kita langsung you. aja. Nggak usah banyak nanya. Tertakutnya malah kenapa-napa lagi. Ini kunci. Tadi ada beberapa kali starter gitu sih gara-gara PC gue sih kayaknya. Oh ini dia. File Suanda. Coba kita cek. Mana? Nggak ada. Eh salah pencet. File Victor. File kita. Tadi gue pengen ngulang cuman ya udahlah males lanjut aja lah. Tadi pas sebelum battle gue belum keliling kemana kok, belum keliling kemana pun. Jadi gue nggak tahu deh di situ ada apa aja. Wanted notice. Ini dikunci dikunci gini pasti nanti ada yang bisa dibuka. Apakah kita akan balik lagi untuk menyelamatkan si Wanda? Tidak ada barang-barang seperti ya? Oh, kita dapat poin. Bolehlah, poinnya dua lagi. Hmm, gue pengen naikin apa ya? Ini nih, ini gue pengen lucky chance. Terus gue pengen ini gimana? Ini menarik nih. Ini dah. Sip, lanjut. Oke oke oke. Uh, tempatnya luas nih. Eh, salah pencet. Go to your father funeral. Funerals. Ini... Harusnya ke sana. Kita coba keliling-keliling. Ambil-ambilin aja dulu. Gue gak tau sih apakah akan gue cepetin atau enggak Pas jalan-jalannya Soalnya gue bingung mau ngobrol apa Oh ini Coba lihat map nya Tujuan kita tuh ke Oh sini jauh ya Dan ini banyak banget yang mesti dikelilingin Kayaknya sih kita bakalan balik lagi ke sini deh. Iya nih, soalnya banyak banget pintu yang dikunci. Tutup. Gue coba ke salah satu tandanya dulu kali. Yang mana ya? Ini nih. Kita lurus belok kiri. Oke. Oke, gue cobain ke situ dulu. Pengen lihat di situ ada apaan? Ini kok jalannya agak ngadet-ngadet gini. Oh, salah gang gua. Sebelahnya lagi. Ini ini dihancurin atau apa? Oh lagi proses pembangunan kayak. Oh ini 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 ini, bentar. Oh ini naik tram. 
Oh trem semua ya. Oh ini kayak semacam delman gitu. Oke. Okay. Kayaknya kita coba naik dulu deh. Sip. Kayak gue mesti reload game gue nih. Kayak agak sedikit patah-patah. Sedikit ganggu. Kesini lari. Saya lari. Tapi kalau ke bawah, jalan. Bingung gue. Apa ini itu gue ya? Eh bentar, kalau jalan pakai mouse tuh gimana sih? Oh enggak, enggak pakai. Oh. Oh dia kayak itu ya, pakai WASD bisa, pakai mouse juga bisa nih, ditunjuk-tunjuk. Oke, pakai analog aja lah. Musiknya sedih banget dah. Ya elah, muntah-muntah ya. Nggak ada apa-apa nih. Udah gas kali ya. Langsung aja kita ke funeral. Jalanannya becek bot. Eh, mana? Coba, coba. Map tujuan kita ke Oh, enggak ada. Ah, sini. Oh, ini dia. Ini kayak stick gua deh yang error. Masa ke bawahnya nggak bisa lari? Iya. Kalau nggak full kan nggak lari ya. Ah, stick. Ada apa sih lu? Ada lagi kah yang bisa kita ambil? Ya kita ambil-ambilin siapa tahu kan nanti udah nggak bisa lagi. Kuburan kayak gini lebih serem ya kalau dilihat-lihat. Soalnya kayak punya tempat tinggal gitu. Nih. Apalagi gue lupa namanya. Sip, sepertinya itu udah menunggu kita. Oh, kita ngobrol dulu. I'm sure you don't remember me. My name's Hayat. Mordechai Hayat. I wanted to offer my condolences. Thank you. Please, forgive my prying. I know Mr. Shulsky took nitroglycerin for his heart, but how did he pass away? Was that his cause of death? His heart? Uh, <laughs> kalau jawab ini kacau sih. Iya kita nggak tahu sih. Gua tanya deh. I'm curious myself. I haven't had a chance to find out. Yes, I I understand. My condolences once again. I'll leave you alone. I'm sure you want to bid farewell to your father.
coba jalan di sini oh ada loh ada jejaknya tuh meskipun kayak nggak nggak real time gitu ada 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 beberapa ada yang real time kita coba ngomong lagi I think I ought to arrest you down my dirt Why? I haven't done anything, officer. What's the problem? I barely recognize you either. You still haven't figured out who I am? Don't be surprised. The last time we saw one another was 20 kilos ago. <laughs> <laughs> Uncle Veronian? I will not keep you. That guy is probably all alone back there. Among those vultures circling Stasio. I'm sure she'll be glad to see you. Go on. We'll talk later. Wah. Kita ketemu sama saudari kita ya. Masuk. Sister. Hmm. Oh. Victor. Ini dia. Ligia. I'm so glad you came. I wasn't sure if my telegram had reached you. I'm glad too. How are you holding up? All this caught me off guard, but for now I don't have time to think things through calmly. Look at yourself. What happened? Hmm. Apa ya? Coba kita ganti aja subjek. Have you written to mother? Yes, but what can you expect? You know what Nadia is like. It was never her style to show up for family events like this. It's getting late. And we've still got the reading of Papa's will ahead of us at home. And I'll leave you two alone. I suppose you've got your own matters to clear up. <laughs> ah, ya harus yang nomor satu sih menurut gua. Fine, let's get this over with. Meskipun dia ayah yang So, it was me itu. who got it right in the end. Back then on the train platform was the last time we saw one another. 15 years ago. Ah, hmm. uh, kita baca After brief suffering fell asleep in the Lord. Brief? I hope not. Did you write this yourself? <laughs> A tyrant, bigot, and liar, mistakenly absorbed, died after suffering all too briefly. That's better. Definitely closer to the truth. What do? Uh... Chabai. The day you died, You visited me in my dreams. I was a child when you hounded me out of here, and I remember you as you were back then. But in my dream you looked older. <laughs> you gave me hell as usual. You didn't believe I'd succeed. You were wrong. I've come back with two salutars. Yeah. I'm sorry there are so many things I didn't get to say to your face. All those years, I said them over and over to myself in my head. How you were never able to admit a mistake. You never sought blame in yourself. Someone else was always guilty. Never you. Mother, because she wanted something for herself in life. Ligia, because she wasn't born a boy. Me, because I was born a thaumaturge, but I didn't want to live following your principles. And now <sighs> Oke, okay, udah semua. Farewell, father. Am I intruding? Siapa nih? Hmm. Apa ya? What do you want? <laughs> well, What do people come to funerals for? I came to pay my respects to the dead. Stanislav and I were acquainted. 
You might say I knew everything about your father. Mr. Viktor Shulsky, isn't it? Victor. Your absence from Warsaw has happily come to an end, I hope. Dia kenapa tuh? Hmm. Apa ya? Ini? I don't think so. I intend to leave as soon as I wrap up my family obligations. I doubt we'll have time to meet again. <laughs> Who knows? Again, my condolences. I didn't catch your name. My name's Konyechkin. Ivan Konyechkin. Konyechkin. Goodbye. Such interesting friends you had. Itu duduknya gak nempel ya? Gak nempel bangku. I, I guess I'm more tired than I thought. Jangan-jangan bokapnya punya saluter satu lagi. Akhirnya bisa keliling. Great grandmother Yusefina, a thaumaturge. Oh satu keluarga tuh di sini semua ya. Grandpa Nikolim, a thaumaturge. I barely remember him. Kita cek cek lagi. Oh sekarang kose ada dua nih. Bolehlah nambah. Sementara kan. Relaxation. Lucky chance. Lucky chance ini buat bagusan. Ini dah. Relaxation nggak bisa taro di mana mana lagi. Eh kok balik lagi? Bentar bentar bentar. Lucky chance ke sini. Relaxation ke sini. Coba aja. Dah. Sip, kita keluar. Oh iya ini namanya mausoleum. Mausoleum. Tuh namanya mausoleum. Uh, apa? Tempat. Ya tempat ini. Tempat tinggal jenazah ini. Kita kemana sih? We can go. The hardest thing was getting the lid of the urn. The scattering I could handle. You can play the clown, but I know how much this has cost you. I'm glad you went. Ya tuh adiknya atau kakaknya sih? At a funeral. Eros postmortem. Is it suitable for a young lady in mourning to fraternize with bachelors? Konstantia <laughs> Shabovska, the Warsaw courier. Could I ask for a brief comment? I know. Airnya. Thank you. Airnya kena baju sir? itu. Hmm. <laughs> Mesti ngajak ribut banget ya. Uh, Gue ini aja. I can sort it out, but it might cause you some trouble. It's not worth getting your hands dirty over. Get out of here, or I might decide you're attacking an imperial official, and you'll wake up tomorrow in the citadel. Are you threatening me, Judge? I'm actually sparing you from him. Would you rather try your luck with a taumaturg? <laughs> Come on, children. I'm sure my Pietia is already waiting for us at home. I'd love to see my cousin. Are you coming with us? Uh, yeah, there. thanks. Get in. I'm sure the lawyer is already waiting for us. Ish, bagus. Okay, udah nyampe lagi nih. yang penting ini masih pada ditutup semua Miss 
Your guests have arrived. The lawyer's upstairs too, waiting. But try for jittery. Wonder if the tea I made him was too strong. Thank you, Grazina, dear. Let the guests wait. First, I want to take care of the will. I'll just wet my whistle and join you all upstairs. Make sure Uncle makes it upstairs sober. And I'll suggest you don't dawdle either. Yep. Master Victor, good God! Half your face covered, but I could tell right away it was you. You look just like your father in his youth. Completely his spitting image. <laughs> Should I make you some cocoa, Master? It <laughs> would warm you up a little. Enak tuh. Mau, mau, mau. Ini aja deh. Make an extra creamy one oh, for Oh, bisa. Okay, okay. Oh, I won't skimp on her. Now, your sister's putting a brave face on all this, but she's really having a hard time. It's lovely to see you again. But that's enough jabber for now. I've got the guests and the cocoa, and I've got to whip up some food for you all later. We'll talk soon. Sip, sip. Kita keliling, keliling lagi. Ini acaranya di sini, atau oh, bukan? Siapa nih? Oh, Pitya ini si kasennya, sepupunya. Nanti nanti kita lihat-lihat dulu. Ada basement juga. Eh, ya kepencet. Oh, I'm glad you're here. I thought I'd have to drink alone. So many goodies laid out for the guests. Having trouble picking something for yourself, Judge? But this was Stasio's. It was special. Amber liqueur with quinces. I think you mean quince liqueur with amber, right? If it's not here, I'm sure it's in the basement. But I won't grope around down there in the dark now. I've got my hands full. Now, I don't want to trouble you either. Victor, could you track down a little bottle for your uncle? <laughs> I suppose I'm obligated to accept this mission. <laughs> Good lad. A nephew like you is a treasure. Oke, okay, kita dapat tugas baru tuh untuk ngambil botol di sini bawah sini. Morana. Kita keluar dulu ya. Hujan. Nggak ada apa-apa. Masuk lagi. Kita keluar cuma buat hujan-hujanan doang. Nah, kita ngobrol sama sepupu kita. Si Pietia. Pieta. Pietia. Apa sih? Susah banget. I don't want to put my foot in my mouth again. I already failed to recognize someone once today. But you look familiar. Well, I should think so. I was the victim of one of your starling hunts. <laughs> Voronins must not be very memorable, cousin. Pietia! <laughs> Forgive me, and for shooting you as well. Ha! Huh. How are you doing? Just some heart problems, not a subject for today. I'm sorry about Uncle Stanislav. Forgive me for not coming to the funeral. I can't bear cemeteries. We'll have to meet up again. Goodbye. Oke, okay, kita nggak dapat quest. Sip, gua ngambilin botol dulu, baru habis itu naik. Wah, gua kira gelap, ternyata nggak terlalu. Wah, itu nyokapnya, cantik banget. Mana? Wanda. Oh iya, si Rasputin kemana dah? Tahu ah? Oh, 
Oh betul. Okey terus sini. Midi. Lu kira yang yang ada di atas sini ni? Udah. Oh ini dia. Eh salah pencet. Pinot Noir. Okay, takasi. How did it go? Mission accomplished. <laughs> hmm. Eh, yang mana lagi tadi ya? Ini kan? Cok, cok, cok. You have to wait a moment here, Tonko. Mana sih tadi? Eh, salah. Uh, Pinot sama ini. Ya, liquor ini kan? Ember liquor tadi. How did it go? Mission accomplished? Ini. I think this is the one uncle wanted. Yes. This is our little funeral battle. We would meet in Stasha's study after every funeral we went to and raised a toast to the dead. And recently, we've been seeing one another more and more at such events. More and more. But this time, even he has left me. So, to an easy death, as Stasha and I used to say. Hmm. How did he die? Hasn't Ligia told you? I haven't even had the chance to ask. He didn't suffer, but such images in the memory are better saved for later. I'd prefer to remember him as he was alive. What then? Am I drinking alone? Mm. Yep. Familiar faces keep vanishing from my life. Stasio and my Helena before him. I miss my little darling. I miss them both. Well, obligation fulfilled. Shall we get to the reading of the will? Ayo. Uh, coba kita tanya dulu ya. At the funeral, there was this sad Jewish fellow. Mordechai Hayat. Do you know him, Uncle? He worked for Stanislav, but that was a long time ago. I don't know him more than that. So, shall we collect our inheritance? Udah semua sih. Yes, let's find out what my father hasn't left me. Let's begin if everyone is ready. Would you all please take a seat? Ladies and gentlemen, by the power of my office vested in me by the grace of His Imperial Majesty, the Emperor of All Russia, I hereby testify. Mr. Shulsky's last will and testament were prepared several years ago in the presence of Zaslav Fedorov, Esquire, that is, myself. My last will and testament recorded in the year of our Lord 1888. In the name of the Holy Trinity. Amen. Mm, okay. Therefore, my first irrevocable wish is to appoint as executrix of this will my daughter, Ligia Schulzka. Immediately after my death, an inventory shall be conducted in full accordance with the law. After completing the inventory, all my personal movables will be sold at public auction. Hmm. And let the funds raised thereby be donated on the anniversary of my death to the beggars near the cemetery. Ah. The administration of the remainder of my fortune I leave, without restriction, to the person of my daughter, Ligia. <sighs> I'm not even getting a teaspoon. <laughs> All movables and immovables relating to the family enterprise I entrust to the care and administration of my daughter. 
I do not prescribe a method of administering them. I merely offer her one piece of advice. What the? I wish that the business should be conducted with modesty, prudence and honesty, as I have conducted it my whole life. Pasti protes. A joker to the very end. <laughs> <laughs> to my brother-in-law and oldest friend, Alexander Voronin, I wish to leave the following. Okay. My collection of muskets and two revolvers dating to the uprising in memory of our first meeting. Stasio, I will have plenty to do in my retirement. Enjoy your retirement. Hmm. Apa ya? Aduh. Tempting banget ya. Uh, ini dulu. Now, Mr. Fedorov, what did my father leave my mother? Hmm? Victor, be serious. Nothing. There is a special item reflecting the absolute lack of any bequest to my former spouse, Nadia Fyodorovna Voronina. Okay. I would also like to come to the aid of my only son, Viktor Shulsky, by entrusting him with the use of my personal black grimoire, in the hope that he will be able to make good use of it. This is my last will and testament. Carry it out solemnly, though you may have found it burdensome. However, this last bequest poses a certain problem. Yes, it certainly does. And what is that, may I ask? I am not in possession of this grimoire. The late Mr. Shulsky used it up until his death. Yet no one left it with me after his passing. Meaning it's disappeared? Oh, bisa. Itu buku yang berbeda ya berarti ya? Did father have his grimoire on him at the time of his death? It was only because of the grimoire that we could identify him at all. Hmm. What actually happened? How did he die? A building collapsed on top of him. Odu. I don't know any other way of putting it. Uh, aduh, mudah-mudahan bisa tanya semua nih, gue penasaran. Tanya dulu di mana. Where did it happen? Where was this building? The southern part of Shudmishti, not far from the police station. Anyway, you can miss it. Of all the possibilities, this was the death that fate prepared for him. Ah, gue pengen banget sih jawab ini. Karena dia kan kesel banget buka apa ya? Coba lah. He died as he lived, miserably. He couldn't have met a more fitting end after what he did to me. What he did to the Nijic family. You've got to know that Papa felt guilty. Even if he didn't say so outright. I'm not going to defend him, but I can't criticize him either. Even I don't know what really happened back then with Abauritsa. An accident is what happened, and Father treated two kids like the worst disgraces in the world. As if it had been premeditated. When a person dies so suddenly, their unfinished business remains. We'll never learn what Stasio carried in his heart. What do you intend to do? Gua tanya-tanya dulu dari Ivan Konyetskin. Father evidently knew a certain Ivan Konyetskin. Have you heard anything about him? Konyetskin. No, doesn't ring a bell. All sorts of people came to Papa's store. That doesn't mean every one of them might know something about the grimoire. That's true. You've got your work cut out for you. And Mordechai Chayat. Could that be a lead? I don't think so. 
He worked with father, but he left more than a year ago. I don't know why. He was an assistant at our, well, my store. Do you know where I might find him? Sadly, no. Do you have any other ideas? And where are father's things at the moment? You're standing at the very center of his kingdom. Not everything has been sorted through yet, but you go right ahead. And the store? I should check the too. I've started stock taking there to distract myself, and I don't want you to go in there before I've finished. As you wish. I think we have to look for the answer in the place where it happened. With your sight, you can make out more in those ruins than I, or uncle, or detective could. This is a good lead, but is it the only one? Now at least I can see how little I know. Maybe these scraps of information will lead me somewhere. Well, now that we know what's got to be figured out, forgive me, my darlings. I'm going to give my old bones a rest. I'll see you out. Seru nih kita membongkar apa yang terjadi dengan kematian ayah kita nih. Goodbye, uncle. And uh, Ligia. I'm sorry it happened this way. That I wasn't close by. The most important thing is you're here now. Okay, kita cek apapun yang ada di sini. Tiba-tiba si Opir ada di situ tuh. Ya, pasti itu hal utamanya di situ sih. Uh, tahun 1896. Ambil ambil aja. Sorry ya nggak gue baca. Ini kok ada nyala nyala? Oh enggak. Kok kayak dengar suara. Gila kuno banget ya. Tapi cantik. Kamar mandinya sama kamar gua kayak masih gedean kamar mandi dia deh. Oh, bisa ganti baju. Cuman gua nggak bisa eh cuman gua nggak punya apapun sih. Kayaknya sih kalau beli yang deluxe bakalan bisa ganti baju deh. Cuman gua belum tertarik untuk beli yang deluxe. Kayak gua kayaknya suka sama game ini tapi Nggak tahu, belum mau beli yang deluxe. Kecuali ada sesuatu yang benar-benar menarik ya baru ku pengen sih. Oh, dia banyak patung-patung kayak gini ya. Coba deh, kita kelarin yang di atas dulu baru ke bawah. Oh, ada topeng. Oh, di atas ada. Belum ke sini. Ini apa nih? Apa itu? Oh, ini foto keluarganya ya tahun 1884 lama banget ngobrol dulu atau dengerin dulu ya 
dengerin dulu deh oke how do you find our old stomping ground yes I'm not too fond of this place either this is where I had my last conversation with my father just before I left if you can call it a conversation can you see my dreams nightmares actually Ever since I decided to come back, I keep reliving the same memory. The loan shark incident. I've been seeing his death more and more lately. I wonder if his shop is still there. Perhaps we should go there and check. Kemana lagi? Wah, kalau masih ada merah-merahnya harusnya belum belum komplit nih. Di mana lagi? Hmm. Ah, ini dia. Oke. Okay. Dah. Untung aja, gua ngecek-ngecek. Sekarang kita bisa ke bawah. Angkat dulu. Halo. I talk here. Do you hear me now, Victor? Victor, are you there? Grigori? Yes. Dia baru bisa telepon apa? On the other end of the line at home where the telephone rang. <laughs> Incredible. Uh, apa ya? Ini dah. How did you know I have a telephone at home? Uh, something's interrupting you, Victor. I am telecommunicating with you to say I found lodgings here in Warsaw. If you need me, I'm by the cemetery. Uh, what number is it? Uh, yes, yes, Seven Povaskoska Street, uh, number seven by cemetery, Povaskoska. I'm glad. It's good to hear your voice. <laughs> It's good to hear you as well. Uh, goodbye. Yeah. Uh, I want to end now. What do I uh, like this? Wonderful. <laughs> Remarkable, hello. Lucu banget. Gila bahkan telepon aja belum umum loh waktu itu. Berarti tahun berapa ini ya? Apa nih? Kita minum dulu. Apalagi nih? Apa ini? Oke, ada collectibles lainnya. Oh, banyak deh ini. Ini juga ada lagi nih. Ya, kepencet lagi. Oh, agak patah-patah ya ada apakah sebenarnya uh, bentar bentar basement musiknya juga soalnya agak patah-patah gitu Lalu kita ngobrol dulu Master Victor let me guess have you come for some hot cocoa hmm Something stronger. Don't there happen to be anything stronger? I see you're all grown up. There's hmm. still a little homemade liqueur if Judge Voronin's not polished it all off. Help yourself. It's been an age since we've seen one another. I'm glad you're back. 
Mistress Ligia is really struggling with everything. Mm. Ligia won't open up to me, but how is she doing? She's having a rough time, the poor dear. Her heart is heavy, though she doesn't show it, but she's strong. She keeps her chin up and doesn't give in. And it's good she's got you to help now, Master. Only she started smoking like a chimney. <laughs> she takes after her father, no question about it. And so the great Stanislav Shulski is dead, crashed by a building. Can't say I'd wish a death like that on anybody. An awful death, sheer cruelty. Mr. Shusky didn't deserve it. Now all we can do is think back on what a wonderful man he was. That won't take long. <laughs> so, this death, what do you make of it, Grzymka? I'll tell you in confidence, Master Shusky. Now, I'm a simple woman, but something about your father's death doesn't sit right with me. How do you mean, Grzymka? Don't you suspect some impure powers had a hand in it? Do you mean it could have something to do with thaumaturgy? That I don't know. Look at us jabbering while there are potatoes not peeled. <laughs> Forgive me, master. Okay. Another time, Grzymka. I'll get out of your way. Always ample work, but I can always snatch a moment for a chit chat with you, Master. Ntar abis gue ngobrol sama si ini, gue mau restart. Have you found anything yet about the grimoire? Is there any way I can help? Hmm, kayaknya sih kalau selalu milih ini tuh bakalan langsung ke selanjutnya gitu loh. Kalau yang ini kayaknya masih bisa muter-muter dulu. Uh, ini dah. The trousers are an original style. Yang nggak penting-penting. Until gitu. now, I'd only seen women in trousers in the East. First of all, they're practical. It's the 20th century. It's high time we started dressing comfortably. You've always been brave. Never afraid of anything or anybody. Like when mother almost had a fit because you dunked my best tie in hot cocoa. I didn't care that she was angry. I wanted to get you back for not wanting to play with me. Because you were being too annoying. You meant to say brave. By the way, Grazina still makes cocoa every evening. You can conjure up the flavor of childhood if you want. Is there anything else you want to talk about? Tadi ketara banget ya potongannya. What's next for you? You're in charge here now. Have you got some kind of grand scheme? A grand scheme? Well, for now, I'm just trying to keep my head above water. Certain customers are unconvinced that a woman can handle running a business. What's worse, a woman without powers. You know what I mean. A thaumaturge at my side would shut them all up. After all, it's your heritage too. Hmm. Apa ya? Ini lah. I don't think I'd be much use. I'm a lousy thaumaturge and I lack the necessary skills. I wouldn't know how to palm off all these oddities and antiques that father used to sell. Thank you, Victor. You've just reassured me that Papa left the business to the right child. <laughs> I trust the smoke doesn't bother you. You used to detest the smell of tobacco. You'd hold your breath going into father's study. That's true, but when I'd stay here, Alone with Papa, and somehow over the years I got used to it. I don't know when I started copying him even. Daddy's girl. You were always closer to him. That's not true. 
I was just less rebellious than you, his thaumaturg son. Now come on, what else is on your mind? In Father's study, I found a trace of a woman that I couldn't identify. Probably Svetlana Rumiantseva. Who is she? And what does Father have to do with her? Svetlana is a Russian aristocrat who travels with the Romanov's court. I can only tell you she was a customer of Father's. A customer? If you don't want to say, then don't. Where can I find her? When she's in town, she stays at the Imperial Hotel. She might know something that will help me find the grimoire. Not so fast. To get in, you're going to need me and my connections. Mm. Svetlana is famous for her soirees where she hosts the Crème de la Crème of Warsaw. I've been to soiree. Oh. <laughs> What's a soiree? How long did you say you lived with Mother in Paris? <laughs> Just a party, if you like. Do you know what that is? Very funny. We could go together. How about you track down some evening clothes and I'll sort out the invitation. And I won't take no for an answer. Sadly, you never give me a chance. Unfortunately, everything in my wardrobe is antediluvian. I need a tailor. There's a shop at 11 Pruzna Street that's fairly decent and quick. We also have barbers in Warsaw in case you want to do something about whatever you have growing on your head and face. Liga? Yes? How did it go in? Kok, tapi kok masih bisa diajak ngobrol? Bingung gua. Saatnya kita jalan-jalan nih. Oh, ini nih. Uh. Eh, ini gerak. Oh, enggak. Gerak sendiri. Balik ada apa aja di sini? Ada banyak nih buat dikelilingin. Sip, sip, sip. Yang logonya waktu ini apa ya? Oh. Let's wait. Ya. Uh, apa ya? Coba ngobrol so, dulu. Did you miss the city? Wih, ada suara dia. Me neither. Coba, tadi gue baru nyoba sih. Kayaknya itu bakalan bisa ngerubah hari jadi siang mungkin. Terus ke bawah. Kita ngambil ngambil dulu ya baru ke tempat aslinya. Tempat asli, tempat tujuan. Sorry kalau ada suara kucing gue, dia pengen masuk tapi gue nggak bolehin. Takut ngacak-ngacak, gue lagi record ini. Berarti ini harusnya sih tahun 1900-an awal sih menurut gue. Soalnya kan dia sama Bokapeya tahun 1800-an akhir. Oke, gue kesana dulu. Eh, ngomong-ngomong kita harus visit barber juga ya. 
nanti deh malam-malam buka ternyata nih Oh ini apa nih Oke yang tadi tuh sorry ya kepencet kepencet escape mana gua bentar bentar oh sini seberang seberang eh nah eh, ini foto asli atau an atau 3D ini kalau 3D sih asli bagus banget ini looks so real apa ini harusnya udah semua ya makanya gue berhenti dulu sampai sini soalnya sebenarnya gue udah main sampai chapter 1 ya kelar sampai X1 nya kelar ternyata panjang banget ya buat gue totalnya untuk X1 doang yang tadi ya gue rencana untuk upload ya per chapter atau per X ternyata gue rubah juga konsepnya jadi gue potongnya per berapa ya gue juga bingung sih per suka-suka gue aja mungkin per satu jam atau per satu setengah jam soalnya gue pribadi lebih nyaman ngeditnya di angka segitu lah pokoknya jadi sorry banget kalau misalkan motongnya kurang pas atau gimana terus juga sorry banget kalau misalkan terjemahannya agak kurang oke okay atau enak dibaca ya kalian bisa kasih inputnya aja nanti tapi yang pasti di X1 ini tadi kita udah berkunjung ke pemakamannya ayah kita si Stainslow kalau nggak salah dan juga baca-bacain warisan-warisannya kita nggak dapat apa-apa kecuali buku yang mana bukunya itu malah hilang nggak tahu kemana ya jadi mungkin di part selanjutnya kita bakal nyari semua lah yang menjadi pertanyaan dari semua ini apa yang terjadi sama bokap kita apa yang terjadi sama buku Terus apa hubungannya Terus bagaimana semuanya bisa terjadi Ya nanti mungkin akan terjawab di belakang-belakang Ya tapi untuk sementara kita sampai sini dulu Thank you banget yang udah nonton Kita ketemu lagi di part selanjutnya Bye-bye